from Sean Kent Hayashi with Saucon Valley cute and cuddly schnauzers and sometimes a schnoodle. Anne is working on our little Luca boy here, giving him that traditional schnauzer cut. And oh my goodness, doesn't he look beautiful? It makes me think Biscotti should have a schnauzer. He just too. looks so <laughs> handsome. Hi, Luca. You're coming along so nicely and you're being so good on the grooming table. He is. Yeah. Well, he knows Peter. What do you think? And I have his sister here sort of watching a little bit just so she can see what's happening. Yes, tomorrow, Luca, is your gotcha day. Yes. Luca, you are one beautiful boy. Yes. Oh, my goodness, Luca. Look at those beautiful green eyes you have. Just gorgeous. So Luca's coloring is a chocolate and tan, and he has a lot of red in him. And Anne, you have once again just done such a beautiful job. Thank you. He's a joy. He's a joy. <laughs>
hand fed, which is great for them. And you can see he's very comfortable with my hands and with playing. So up next, I'm gonna to try to take some photos here of Chief to send to his family. Yeah, let's see if I can do that. <laughs> This little boy is Baxter. Baxter will also be staying with us for six weeks of puppy prep school. And he will be going to live next door to Bogey. Hi, Baxter. Baxter has blue eyes. I don't know that they show up well in video like this, but when he is outside with sunlight shining on him, you can see that those are beautiful blue eyes. Yeah. There you go. What a cutie you are, Baxter. On Baxter's gotcha day, he will be in a teddy bear style. Yeah. She wanted to see, Tam wanted to see Baxter's blue eyes. So I said, okay, let's come outside and I think you'll be able to see in the sunshine. Do you see those blue eyes? Yes. Isn't that Beautiful. fun? Yeah. Beautiful. Since these two puppies were born, I have been calling them the twins. They look a lot alike. And when they were born, they both had some spots on their head here. But this one, this is Leo. And Leo does not have so much white on his head. And this is Bandit. And Bandit does at this point have that halo still on the top of his head. And Bandit, and Leo both have brown noses, both have green eyes. Their gotcha day will be on October 3rd. In other words, right when they turn eight weeks old. They will also both be in the teddy bear style when they go to their new homes. And now what I'm going to try to do is get individual photos of each one. So individual photo of our little boy, Leo. and our little boy, Bandit. Kim is helping me. I'm so grateful for Kim's help here because this is not something that uh, I can do all by myself. So Bo, yes, Bo, we have you in there with Ginger's puppies, even though you're a lot older because, well, oh my goodness, you're actually smaller than they are, Bo. But isn't he a cutie pie? He is the sweetest. You are the sweetest. He loves interacting. He gets so excited when he's going to see new people. He's one of these kind of puppies that he's going to be tiny all the time. And we really have to keep an eye on, you know, if you have a puppy this small, you really have to keep an eye on uh, walking around. So if you have a puppy like this underfoot, you have to ice skate is the way I like to think about it. Yeah, you do. We have to ice skate with you, cutie pie. He loves to play and cuddle. He gets so excited to see anybody. Now you might be saying, hey, Sean, don't the other puppies do that? Yes, they do. It's just, I don't know, sort of funny when it's a puppy that's half the size of the other ones it's behaving like that. Yeah, we're having a fun gotcha day for you today. We are, we are. Notice we've tired out these puppies with so much play. Say yes. Hey, Cole. Hi, beautiful boy. Yeah. Cole is nine weeks old and Cole is staying with us for four weeks of puppy prep school. You might remember last weekend, Cole's sister Skylar and sister Shelby had their gotcha days and went to their new homes. And I have heard from their moms that they are doing very well. Yeah, all is well. When I mentioned that mom is Nellie and dad is Maui, I think it was Tam who said, oh, this is a half sibling then to Wavy Davy Jackson. <laughs> and that is correct. I was laughing saying, well, most of them are half siblings around here because of uh, Maui. Maui has been very prolific this past year. 
Yes. And this upcoming year, we'll be saying the same thing about truffles and mocha because I have a lot of puppies on my list. People want chocolate color. And so in order to get those chocolate color puppies that are currently on my waiting list, I will be breeding mocha and truffles. Yes, look at you, cutie pie. Cole's mom, Deb, lives very close to me. And as a result, since he is nine weeks old and in puppy prep school, he will be able to go to her home in the evenings and come back here for puppy prep school. Yeah, that'll be fun, won't it? Cole will be in the traditional schnauzer style on his gotcha day, which will be coming up in three weeks. Very fun. Looking forward to that, Deb. This is Misty, and Misty is staying for eight weeks of puppy prep school. She is also one of Nellie and Maui's puppies. Yes. And Kim just said, Misty, you are so calm. And I say, yes, I just woke her up from a nap. <laughs> Any of them will be this calm when just woken up from a nap. I say, yeah, I'm a very sweet little girl, aren't I? Pretty Misty. On Gotcha Day, Misty will be going to live in Colorado. And I believe that your family is driving here to get you, Misty. Or maybe they're flying and a part of their trip includes some driving. That might be it. But, Misty, you'll be in a traditional schnauzer when you have your gotcha day. Yes, what a pretty girl you are. So, Misty, you are so photogenic. And I will say that part of that is just that I woke her up from a nap so she's not moving so quickly and therefore it's easier to take good photos of her. But literally every photo that we took of her was a good one. So there were no blooper outtakes with you, girlfriend. Kim and Tam gave me a tripod. Woohoo! How thoughtful of you. And we are going to try to set it up today to see how I might begin to use it in recording videos. And you can see here's our stage set for what we've been doing. This is Nero. Hi, Nero. Some of us call her Cafe Nero. This little girl is going to live in Boston and she will be here a long time. We are keeping her through full puppy prep school, but then even beyond puppy prep school, her mom would like her to be trained to the level of a therapy dog. So that is our goal with you, little Miss Nero. We will be including Nero in lots of training videos and showing you how we take her beyond that 16 week mark even and the kinds of things that we do to help her have what she needs to be a certified therapy dog. Jackson has been trying to get his aunt, auntie, to play with him. And she says, no. She's teaching him some new things. She's teaching him about, she's teaching him about boundaries and respecting space. And this is why doggy socialization is so good. He says, I, I don't know if I like these lessons, but notice his tail, his tail is wagging. Hi, Jackson. Yeah, yeah, his tail is wagging. Hi, pretty boy. Look at how pretty you are, Jackson. Yes. This is a Leo. I woke him up from a nap, too. You can tell. Yes, cutie pie. Leo is here for four weeks. He will be going to live in Florida. Yeah, you will. Pretty boy. He will be in a traditional schnauzer on gotcha day. Very pretty boy. 
Yes. Pretty boy. Say, the photo shoot took a lot out of us and it's now nap time, huh? When I look at the weights, the weights at six weeks old for these ginger puppies, they are all charting to weigh between eight and 10, 11 pounds. So they'll be somewhere in that range. Yeah, you are the biggest one, Mr. Baxter. In the next few clips here, you're going to see what happened with when Tam, Kim, and I tried to use the tripod to see how it might impact how I make videos. All right, so I'm laughing because they are sitting under the tripod looking up at the camera. <laughs> so, of course, if I were holding my camera right now, I would be... But, you know, we raised it and then tilted it. Uh, then you, if you wanted just to get the... Uh, but yes. We have been having so much fun playing with these technology tools. So the tripod that Kim and Tam gave me and this device that Joyce, Skylar's mom, gave me that I'm able to put over my head and have the camera on this device so that you get different angles of my shots. But one of the things that I can't help but point out is we've been talking now for quite a while, having lots of fun. What do you notice? It's very quiet because it's nap time here. And I asked Kim and Tam if they wanted a blanket and a pillow and they chuckled at me. But we've, we've just been having so much fun here, hanging out, playing with all these technologies. Yeah. And, and it has a remote too. So we just practiced by putting the camera in the refrigerator <laughs> and getting the angle on the shot of opening the refrigerator door to get the chopped treats out to see if we might try some really fascinating uh, camera shots for future videos. So giving you a heads up or a warning <laughs> that I will be practicing with uh, some new camera techniques. Thank you so much, Tam and Kim. Wow. This is the power of community because on my own, by myself, sort of figuring out some of these uh, new technology things isn't so fun. But when Tam and Kim come along and do it with me and we've got Wavy Davy Jackson visiting, it just makes it so much more fun. Thank you. Here we go. Like this. And remember, you can flip that around so that you can actually see the screen. Well, I'm guessing this is sort of it, like this. Look at all of these pretty puppies. Lots of chocolate puppies out here. Burberry, ignoring me? Okay, Mocha, Mocha, you never ignore me, except today, when Dazzle is coming in season. Luca loves to play with toys. He loves to play fetch. Oh, wavy, wavy Davy Jackson. Hi. Hello. Hello, look at those boys going down the step together. Jackson, when you arrived, your mom told me you don't know how to do steps. 
<laughs> Going to get another family picture here. That's right, second gotcha day today. Woohoo! Well, here it is. This is it. It was great to hang out with both of you today. Yes. Yes, we always love hanging out with you, Sean. And then there are four. And then there are four <laughs> as they go out the door. door. <laughs> This is my YouTube channel, and on my channel, I have lots of playlists. Would you please put a comment below about any playlists that you would like us to add to our channel? Your questions help us determine what videos to make next. If you have enjoyed this, please give it a thumbs up. And we'd love a comment with at least five words. YouTube needs five words in your comment in order for YouTube to count it. Thank you so much.